Hello everyone, this is Samway Wang from the Department of Civil Engineering. Throughout the course of my study, I have joined quite a number of activities by the Project Mainda Student Association as they provide a platform for civil engineering students to apply their academic knowledge to real life. Due to COVID-19, Project Mainda developed the first project in Hong Kong. Participating in Project Mainda provides a practical opportunity for me while contributing the society. The first project is a renovation work for an NGO, St. Barnabas Society and Home Center, located in Kennedy Town. After years of service, the two-story SBSH Center in Shaktong Choi is showing significant signs of wear and tear. It is in need of a major repair and renovation. There was a water leakage issue which affected the structural strength. Our job is to arrange the maintenance for them. The project team was formed by the students, teachers, SVSH representatives, partnering architects, and contractors. We have come up with a few proposals, including adding solar panels for them to economize the expense of electricity. The reason for raising the idea is that, though the government has nominally charged SVSH cheap in renting, other fees still need to be borne by SVSH. Therefore, if we can lower the expenses, they will have more resources to help people in need. However, we decided to give up the idea after analyzing the uncertainties. As the land belongs to the government, they can terminate the renting any time. It is a matter of course that SBSH needs to move out within a short period. If this has happened shortly after the installation, the cost effectiveness will be extremely low. After finishing the following up design and maintenance, we arranged to have a quality checking by stimulating rain on the roof as shown. In Project Mingda, we had to carry out the calculation, which is the most critical job for a civil engineer, as we need to prove the workability of work. The funniest part of the activity was the dimension of the structural part was missing. It means that we have to take the size of all components found in the roof, such as the channels, equal angles, and universal beam. It was a novel experience as the students we had a few opportunities to contact steel products. Also, we need to pay attention to clients' requirements and explain the idea comprehensively. I realized the importance of communication and presentation skills, since one of the duties of an on-site engineer is to give instructions to junior workers. All the skills I've learned can be applied when I graduate. I'm glad that I joined this meaningful project. I believe it will be a valuable experience for my future career as a civil engineer.